Hey guys, this is Yoga Pose of the Week number 42. Today we're going to work on Tiger Pose. So there's a lot of more challenging and simpler variations for this. And grab a strap if you think that you will need it. I think it's a great prop for this one um, to work on overhead grip. And yeah, let's get to it. Let's look at it. Take a look. Grab my strap too to show you. My Everstretch strap thing is awesome. Alright, so we're going to start on all fours and the most basic or beginner variation just involves me lift one leg up, extend it back and reach it up behind you as high as you can. Really focusing on the weight distribution here between the three limbs that are down. Don't come too far back or too far forward, really find that balance. That's really going to help you in a minute when we move on to the more challenging variations. Okay? So, try on the other side. Again, find that balance. Alright, and now from here, if you want to try strap. Well, before we try the strap, just grab, well we're going to go right hand, no, I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> Left hand is going to grab the top of the right foot. Okay, so slowly find your balance and you're going to push into, push your foot into your hand. Reach back. After this we'll Move to the strap. Okay, switch sides. So now the right hand is going to grab the top of the left foot and press back, press into the hand. But make sure you're not coming too far back or too far forward. Again, find that balance. Try to stay centered here and slowly push. Push against the hand and rise up. See, it's it's hard. I have to find my balance too. Okay. Now <clears throat> strap around the center of the foot. So if that was too challenging, now Oh, actually, this is gonna be really tricky. Oh, because I'm doing the wrong hand. I'm sorry guys. Left hand grabs the strap for the right foot. I don't know why I can't get it together. Okay. So you can use this to practice as well. So you can practice this way, or you can use the strap so you can bring the arm way forward, having all this slack, and look, you're doing overhead grip. <sighs> Great way to practice this. So you can give yourself as much slack as you need and begin working on this. And as you get more flexible, you can climb along the strap and eventually Grab those toes. Okay. So same thing on the other side. But I'm going to do it without the strap. Do use the strap for the other side. So right hand, left foot. I'm going to grab around the toes. Press. If you are here and you're able to work on the overhead grip, make sure you push as far away from you as you can to rotate the shoulder open. There we go. Whew. Okay. And one more. One more variation. 
can grab closer to the knee or the knee of the opposite leg. You can also do this on the same side for all of these, but uh, let's, let's not. <laughs> for balance's sake. So like, you could grab right hand to right foot. I'm not into it. <laughs> All right, so we'll switch sides. Right hand, grab close, or the left knee. Come up. This just helps you get a more straight leg. Okay. So a lot of really fun, challenging variations. Should we try same side? Should we, should we be bold? Oh boy. <laughs> oh, and other side. A little too, a little too challenging for me. Take your time. Take your time. <sighs> Lift slowly. There's no rush. Find the balance. Okay. Wow, that is tough stuff. <laughs> it's a really fun, challenging, and great back bend though. And it challenges, as you just saw, your balance, working on so many awesome things here. So let me know if you've tried this pose before, if you like it, leave me a comment, and let me know how you like it, how it feels for you. If it's your first time trying it and you're like, that is insane, what? Or if you love it, let me know. And like, subscribe, and share. Visit chickyjack.com for plenty more yoga classes and workouts and all kinds of other awesome stuff. Um, I'm Jicky Jack on Facebook and Instagram, where you can follow me for the latest updates of what's going on with me. And if you're on Patreon, become a patron for a dollar to three dollars a month to see all of these classes and instructional how-to videos earlier than the public. You get earlier access to it, see it quicker, you get more of it, more often, faster. <laughs> and your support means the world to me. You will eventually see it free here on YouTube as well, but there will be more new content that you're missing out on because it's always rolling out faster and earlier, sooner. I keep using the same adjectives. Anyway, <laughs> your support means the world to me if you can help support me because this does take a lot of time and effort and I absolutely love doing it, but yes, thank you. Hope you enjoyed practicing and have a wonderful week. Thanks guys.